Okay guys, Wet Movie One back here again for another out and about video for you guys today. Right now, I'm in Hollywood, California, like I always am. It's windy as hell, and I'm going on over right now to the Man's Chinese Theater to pick up some uh, a special ticket for an event that's happening a little bit later on tonight, uh, revolving around the Mortal Kombat franchise, baby. It's gonna be a, f a really fun night. But right now, like I said, I'm going on over here uh, to pick up my ticket and then head on over to a different special event that's happening right before the Mortal Kombat one. So come along with me and let's see how this night turns out. Well guys, just got my ticket for the Mortal Kombat movie tonight. Oh yeah, the original one in theaters, baby. But the cool thing is, guys, about seeing this movie in theaters, since it hasn't been in theaters in, since 1995, is that some of the cast members tonight are going to be there. Uh, Robin Shu, the guy who played Liu Kang, is going to be there, along with the guy who played Scorpion and Johnny Cage, and uh, Paul W.S. Anderson, the director of the film, uh, over here. But people over here at the Chinese theater taking pictures and like looking at people's handprints on the floor, like Eddie Murphy's uh, down over here. But hey. I ain't no tourist, man. I just had to come get my shit, say hello to Chewbacca, and keep on going to the next event that I'm going to now, man. It should be kind of cool. Well, guys, I'm over at my next destination of the day, Book Soup over here in Hollywood, and it's right across the street from the old school Tower Records, man. Sad to say, Tower Records is no longer there. It's just an empty old part, an empty building with just a parking lot people have to pay to park in. But guys, as you can see, there's already a line over here for the event that's going on. And you guys may still be asking yourselves, what the hell is the event for, Brendan? Well, guys, it's a book signing for John Waters' new book, Making Trouble, or Make Trouble over here. You guys all know John Waters right over here, man. He's going to be here in a little while signing autographs and taking pictures and things. I brought my very cruelly yours uh, DVD box set featuring a lot of his films over here. Hopefully he'll, uh, you know, sign it for a brother. I've been a big fan of his for years, you know, growing up, just watching films and things. And just his sense of humor is totally my kind of sense of humor, especially like the old Divines, you know, movies that he did, uh, you know, back in the day. And of course, Hairspray and stuff. I just, I'm just a really big fan of his. One of my favorite movies uh, he ever did is uh, Cecil B. Demented. That movie was just amazing to me. But uh, it'd be kind of cool to actually meet the legend himself tonight because he, he, I'd never seen him come out in this area before. Uh, to be honest, he's always like in, uh, you know, like New York or like, uh, I, I, can't, I, can't, I can't remember. He's never really out here in LA, but it'd be kind of cool. Uh, I'm in line right now and the thing doesn't start for another like two hours or so. But half hour after this event starts, the other one starts at the Demands Chinese Theater for the Mortal Kombat, baby. Okay guys, it's about half hour before John Waters signing starts and it looks like the line goes up and around the, the block over here and uh, it's growing and growing. Hi, Mr. Hi. Waters. How are you? Big, big, big fan of yours, sir. Thank you. Thank you for coming out here. I haven't seen you ever come out to you know this oh, L I've LA before. Oh, I've done times. Oh, you have? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, maybe I missed it or something. Yeah. Who's it to? Uh, can you put uh, to the artist? Mm-hmm. The artist known as uh, the artist version one on YouTube. Yeah, and this one right here is this to Brendan or John Waters is fine. No, but to who? Brendan. B R E N D A N. All right. All right, Brendan. All right, guys, I'm with the master of filth, the king of cringe right now, John Waters. We're here for celebration of his new book right here, uh, Making Trouble, or Make Trouble. Make Trouble, yeah. Make Trouble. And uh, how are you doing today? Lamar? I'm doing well. Are you kidding? It's a great bookstore. We've got a huge crowd. Everybody got their roots done today, including oh, you. Well, not, not really. I, I, just have, I just have the gray going <laughs> and everything right now. But I just have a quick question for you. Yeah. What is the movies that inspired you to be, you know, become the king of cringe when it comes oh, to the filmmaking? Well, William Castle and Walt Disney and Andy <laughs> Warhol and, and the Kuchar brothers. Really? Yeah. All right. Is it, you, you like to plug anything on here? Since no, I'm, I'm plugging Make Trouble. That's the new book. That's yeah. a, give anyone you know that's had problem graduating. Yeah, make sure right. you guys check this out online. Thank All you, right. Thank you, Mr. Water. You're, you're See ya. the man. Well, guys, I just met the legendary John Waters, signed my very crudely yours DVD set over here, and signed his new book. Uh, that I got over here for a very special friend that I love online not love you know We're, we're, we're really good friends and uh, when you're watching this video man if you're watching this video surprise for you homie surprise for you But it's so cool to meet a legend uh, like that, but right now uh, <laughs> It's about a little after I guess like what time is it now? Let me see it's uh, 728 and the second event that I have to go to, the Mortal Kombat screening, uh, starts in two minutes. 
Ha! I gotta get up over there. All right, guys, back on Hollywood Boulevard right now, heading on over uh, to the Man's Chinese Theater. Uh, I'm about 10 minutes late uh, to the Mortal Kombat screening right now. Hopefully everything turns out okay, because some of the cast members, like I said, are gonna be there. It's gonna be a celebrity meat fest today, so let's go. Well, guys, just made it to the event. Well, I think I did. <laughs> I see Scorpion over there. I, I made it on over here. Here we go, guys. We got some of the actors uh, from Mortal Kombat over here. Uh, doing their thing, signing people's uh, DVDs, Blu-rays, posters, uh, what have you. So, dude, what's up, bro? How's it going? I watch your videos, dude. Oh, thanks, man. So, like, you, you, you just got here? Whoa! Whoa! Chris, what's up, bro? Did you just get your stuff signed? Uh, I already got my stuff signed. I just took pictures of everybody. You did? What's up, man? What's up? I, I, I didn't know you were coming. Yeah, yeah, last night. There's the man himself, Corey Davis. If it wasn't for him, this event wouldn't happen. Oh, yeah, photo shoot time. Fans of all your work. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Did you ever play the Mortal Kombat game? And if you did, what was one of your favorite characters that you played that's not your character in the film? That's not Johnny Cage. I only you, only, you only ever picked Johnny Cage? I only ever picked Johnny Cage. Yeah. All right. Well, what was your favorite one? Do you have one of the of the game series? Uh, you know, I played just the arcade one. Oh, yeah? Just the original one? Yeah, the original one. Gotcha. I would be in a Resident Evil without Mortal Kombat. Hello, Robin. Nice to meet you, my man. My name is Brendan. Yeah, big fan of yours, my man. Well, thank you so much for coming out. You guys make this amazing, you know? All right, guys. In the movie theater right now, the film is about to start right after the film. Here's going to be a Q&A with the director and the actors. Oh yeah. including Robin Shu, who was apparently not happy about being shirtless too much. <laughs> we were extending <cutting> budget. <laughs> Spend all on that leather dress. Oh, <laughs> um, no, guys, thank you guys for being here. Paul, once again, this is an honor to do this. And right. Robin, and now we have Lyndon, too. Um, um, so let's actually take it back uh, to the basics. This, this is the best video game adaptation out there, I feel. Yeah. I love you too, but I feel like Mortal Kombat is, is, it just doesn't die, which is great. Um, but up here, Lyndon, Robin, Paul, were you, you guys a fan of the game? Like, are you biased? Is your favorite character the game Johnny Cage? Is your favorite character the game? Honestly, for me, I had no idea about Mortal Kombat. Seriously, I was working in Hong Kong. We came back here to the state for a vacation. And then they say, hey, you want to go in to audition for this movie, Mortal Kombat? I go, oh, okay, I guess so. And that's it, really. So I had no idea about the game. But I have a friend who played Liu Kang in the video game. So, uh, oh, so. So he told me about the game. So I did play a little bit at the arcade. <laughs> um, and we tried to make something that, you know, was for everybody. And, um, you know, I always saw the movie. I mean, I love the video game, but I saw the movie as kind of a mashup of Enter the Dragon and um, Jason and the Argonauts. Yeah. You know, some of my favorite, you know, my favorite martial arts movie meets my favorite kind of mythic monster movie. And, uh, and that's what I set out to make um, through the lens of Mortal Kombat. I wouldn't be here, I wouldn't have made any of those other movies you mentioned without Mortal Kombat, you know. I was uh, fresh off the boat and I was this young director from England and uh, if this movie hadn't worked, I'd have been sent back to England with my tail between my legs. Uh, and I, I wouldn't have had a career there, because that, you know, everyone in England would have been, oh, oh, we went to Hollywood and it didn't work, oh, darling. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> well, you're not working here either. better than Street Fighter. Um, the best that doesn't work in England. <laughs> Being better than Street Fighter doesn't mean anything. That, that and five pounds will get you a cup of tea. Um, so, you know, and, and and also, I met friends for, you know, for my life, you know, it's, it's very rare that you make a movie and you walk away with as many friends, uh, you know, really close personal friends as I have from this film. Um, no, that's it, you guys. Like, listen, I'm, once again, I'm Corey. Um, I'm at MovieDude18. Um, I love you all, and thank you all for coming. Thanks.
Yo, 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 Chris, bro. The screening is now over. We just did the Q&A up in here. Did you have a good time? I had a fucking blast. It's dope, right? Mortal Kombat. Come on, you so, are you gonna come to the next event that Corey puts on? Uh, I think it's Resident Evil, isn't it? I believe so, yeah. I'm gonna ask him that in a second, but yeah, man, it's always cool uh, running into you. Yes. Bow! Crew member right here, bro. Alright, guys, the screening is now over, and I'm with the master himself, uh, Liu Kang, also known as Robin Shur over here. How's How you doing today, my man? Pretty good, how are you? Pretty good, man. Uh, I just gotta say, watching your films, you know, growing up, it, it was just really inspiring to me to want to become a martial artist. I'm not a martial artist or anything like that, but I just love the whole franchise and being part, you know, you know, watching martial art films and right. stuff. What are the what are the films and or actors that inspired you to want to become a choreographer slash martial artist? I um, mean, obviously Bruce Lee, of course. Yeah. Know, it's just that um, I grew up with watching Bruce Lee movies, and, and I think um, also like growing up in the states is that you know you want to find your ide identity. Mm -hmm. So then I think that's why I got into martial arts because it's from China. The, the martial art that I do is called wushu. Mm -hmm. So then I got to train in China and just kind of like understand that part of the culture in order, like you know, to sort of have my Self, mm -hmm. my my own identity growing up here in America. Yeah, because for a lot of people that are watching this, uh, don't they don't know that you were an actor and working, you know, in the business before you did Mortal Kombat for right. like nine or ten years. Right. You know, and uh, right now you actually have a new short film right. that you made called Earthbound right. that people can go see at the Lemley Theater where in Pasadena. Uh, it's, it's like Lemley Pasadena um, on May 12th through the 18th. Mm -hmm. uh, it's going to be at the Lemley uh, Theater. So you got, make sure you guys check it out. I'm gonna have a link down below to the trailer of this uh, for a short film. Make sure you guys check it out. Show it some love uh, in the comments of the video. But it's just a real honor to be standing Thank next you. to you right Thank now, you. man. Liu Kang himself, Thank bro. You. Thank you so much. Man. Thank you. All right, guys. I'm now with the man of the hour, Corey Davis over here. The guy that put on this event. So how you doing, Corey? I'm doing fine. Excellent. That was the best event I've ever done, and uh, I'm pretty It was pretty actually a lot of fun, it. dude. The Q&A came out really the well. The Q&A was very smooth. It was oh, very awesome. brilliant. Yeah, like I, thought it was, so. I thought it was very cool that you got the people that you got to come here. And you're I, I did. With them. It's just because they're, they're all such a great family together. I mean, you can see it in the Q&A. Mm -hmm. They were all... Um, a unit, a big family, and um, I was honored. This is truly an honor. I mean, Power Rangers is one thing, but this was a whole other league. Yeah, because Power Rangers was the last one I, I hung out with them at. And uh, so, what is your next event for the people that are watching? Resident Evil. We're doing Resident Evil. Paul's gonna be here. We don't know, or we haven't announced the other guests. You better, yeah. But um, Paul's gonna be here, and it's May 16th at the Chinese Theater at 8 p.m. Oh yeah! Make sure you guys check them out on Facebook. I have a link down below if you guys want to follow him on there. Also on Twitter as Movie Dude 18. 18. So make sure you guys check them out. Uh, links down below. Thanks. Uh, Alright, you're welcome. Bye, buddy. Bye, bye. Alright, everyone. I'm now with the director of Mortal Kombat over here, Paul W.S. Anderson. How are you doing tonight, my man? I'm doing excellent. It was a great screening. It happened for a lot of fun. And you said yeah. in the Q&A that this is one of your favorite movies that you ever that you ever made, right? Yeah, definitely. we got to be careful. As we're walking down these stairs, we don't want to kill ourselves or anything <laughs> like that. But uh, you also... You also directed the Resident Evil movies. Out of all the movies you've made over the years, like um, Invent Horizon and all that kind of stuff, uh, which one would you say, you know, you probably had the hard time, the most hard time, you know, getting done or getting made? Uh, the first movie I ever made. You know, I think that's your your first movie is usually the hardest because, mm -hmm. you know, you've never made a film before. It's a big undertaking. You know, someone has to risk a lot of money mm -hmm. on on someone who's untried. And you know, film directing it's a high pressure job as well. And um, so I. My first movie, I spent uh, several years trying to put together. You know, I was a writer, but I'd never directed a film. I directed some small stuff. So definitely, the first one that was shopping, mm -hmm. which starred Jude Law. Mm -hmm. It was the first time he'd ever been in front of a film camera. Go, oh, okay. And, uh, yeah, and um, you can check it out. Roger Corman distributed it in America. That's pretty cool. Do you have any, any upcoming movies that you like to let people know about that you're, you're working on or thinking about making? I'm working on a movie called Monster Hunter. Okay. Uh, which is an adaptation of a Capcom video game, the same company that uh, made Resident Evil. Oh, that's really, really cool. Well, like, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to me for my, my uh, for the YouTube video. You're, a, you're an amazing person. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Bow. Well, guys, this was a cool evening, uh, if I must say so myself, uh, for me at least, when it comes to making this video and, you know, talking to the people I talk to in this video. Really, really cool. Uh, you know, hanging out with my buddy Corey Davis, who I met. Uh, over at the Power Ranger event that he put on last month and now next month is gonna be Resident Evil that's gonna be 
pretty damn cool, man. I cannot wait for that. But it was also super cool to meet John Waters today, a filmmaking, a filmmaker icon that I've always looked up to and really, you know, admired after all these years. And uh, me meeting and talking to Robin Chu on video, along with the Paul W. S. Anderson, the director of Mortal Kombat. Also got my my Blu-ray signed by all four of the cast members and director that were there. Really, really fun time. Now. I'm back on Hollywood Boulevard. I'm about to head on home and get on out of here. I'm pooped. I did a lot today. But if you guys enjoyed this video, give this video a thumbs up. Check out my all the links down below for the stuff that I talked about in this video. And I'll see you guys all next time.